Welcome to DocBro's channel. DocBro has all the documents you need at your fingertips. Most people are aware of bilateral contracts, agreements between two parties, where each party undertakes to perform certain obligations. However, many people are unaware of or don't understand what unilateral contracts are. A unilateral contract is a contract in which only one party undertakes an obligation to perform in return for some act by the party accepting the offer, known as the offeree. This offer can be made to a specific person or to the whole world. The offeree does not legally have to perform the act and cannot be forced to do so, as they have not undertaken any obligation to perform. If, however, the offeree chooses to perform the act as stipulated in the offer, and does actually completely perform the act, the offeree accepts the offer, and a unilateral contract is formed. It is important to note that the offeree can only accept the offer if he completely performs the act demanded by the offerer in the offer. A common example of a unilateral contract is offers of cash rewards for crime tips. For example, you might see a flyer from your local police station offering $100,000 for information leading to the arrest of a known criminal in your area. Here, the police are the offerers. They undertake the obligation to pay $100,000 in return for an act, the provision of information leading to a criminal's arrest. There's no obligation on anybody to actually provide this information. But if someone does, however, they accept the offer and can enforce this unilateral contract to demand the police to pay $100,000 to them. Other examples may be coupons issued by companies or people offering rewards for finding a missing pet. The offeree may choose to use the coupon or embark on finding the pet, but are under no duty to do so. A unilateral contract must fulfill the usual contractual requirements to be legally enforceable. Generally, these requirements include offer, acceptance, and consideration. For more on these requirements, check out our video in the description on the six essential elements of every valid contract. It is important to note that acceptance for unilateral contracts differs from that for bilateral contracts. First, a valid acceptance must exactly match the terms of the offer. In other words, the offeree must perform the act exactly as specified in the unilateral contract offer. Secondly, unlike bilateral agreements, acceptance need not be communicated to the offerer. This is because the courts have generally implied that an offerer has waived this requirement for communication of acceptance. Mere performance of the act can therefore constitute a valid acceptance without prior notification. The performance of the act also constitutes the consideration for the contract. Overall, a unilateral contract can have binding force, although it may be a set of terms just put forward by one party. If you want to find out more about unilateral contracts, check out the link to our full blog in the description below, which also has a customizable unilateral contract template to create the right documents for your needs. Thank you for watching, and feel free to like and subscribe if you found this video helpful.